The first Masters 1000 tournament of the season at Indian Wells is behind us, with Dominic Team beating Roger Federer in three sets to claim the first title at this level. Taylor Fritz, Riley Opelka, Francis Tifo, Alex Simonor and Alexander Zarev didn't have a good campaign although there were enough youngsters to fight against more experienced rivals at the end of the first and in the second week, with three players born in 1997 or later in the fourth round. Hubert Hurkacz advanced into his first Masters 1000 quarterfinal where he lost to Roger Federer while two teenagers survived until the fourth round for the first time since 2007 when Novak Djokovic and Andy Murray did that, in the desert. Seated 12th and 13th, Novak Djokovic and Andy Murray were already among the favorites at Indian Wells 12 years ago, making nice progress through the draw and ousting David Ferrer and Tommy Haas to enter the last four where Novak took down Andy 6-2, 6-3 in just 63 minutes. Rafael Nadal proved to be too strong versus the Serb in the title match but that was hardly an obstacle for Djokovic who claimed the first Masters 1000 title two weeks later in Miami. At the age of 18, Ryan Harrison won three matches in the desert in 2011, cracking the top 16 where he lost to Roger Federer, repeating the same feat 12 months later just before his 20th birthday. Tennessee Kokinakis was another teenager in the fourth round of Indian Wells in 2015, followed by Alexander Zarev who almost defeated Rafael Nadal in the fourth round in 2016. There were no teenagers in the last 16 at Indian Wells in 2017 and 2018, with all that changing in the previous week when the 26th seed Denis Shapovalov and a lucky loser Miomir Kekmanova carried the banner for 1999 generation to repeat what Djokovic and Murray did 12 years ago. The Canadian defeated Steve Johnson in the second round before a mighty impressive triumph over the 10th seed Marin Cilic 6-4, 6-2, saving all four break points in those two matches to book the place in round four where he lost to another young gun Hubert Hurkacz in three sets. The Belgrade native Miomir Kekmanovic, who works at IMG Academy in Florida, failed to Marco Scorin in the second qualifying round before securing the place in the main draw when Kevin Anderson decided to withdraw. Miomir seized the opportunity with both hands, opening the campaign from the second round and toppling Maximilian Martyrer in an hour to find himself in the last 32, where he overpowered the fellow Sir Blaslo D. Jerry in straight sets to join the fourth round field. There, Kekmanovic had to play only one set against Yoshihito Nishioka who was forced to retire, sending a teenager into the quarters as the youngest player in the last eight in the desert since Michael Chung. In 1991, a former finalist Milos Rana called to the Serb with a 6-3, 6-4 win, saving all three break points he faced and stealing Miomir served once in every set to advance into the semis. Despite this loss, Kekmanovic did enough to reach the top 100 on Monday, joining Felix Agaral Asim and Denis Shapovalov as the third teenager in the elite group.